Hello guys, it's Riker. Welcome back to another video, man. So today we're going to be talking about Manchester City versus uh, Schalke 04 in the Champions League uh, round 16. Uh, second leg, man. So the first leg, man, um, was very excited, man. Uh, Schalke got like two penalties and was up, man. And uh, uh, City made a ultimate comeback, man. Sané really sealing it. And Sané and Sterling really sealing it, man. Sané had an incredible free kick versus his former team, man. So this is going to be a very, very... Um, exciting game, and I do see City winning this one at least 3-0 or 2-0, man, because City is on great form right now. Score for fun. Sterling is a beast. Sané is a beast. And uh, Aguero, Asu, they all beasts, man. So we're going to check this out. Uh, Nicholas Otamendi got a red card in that game, so he's going to be missing this game. Uh, Fernandino, I believe he had, like, uh, too many yellow cards, so he's going to miss this game, too. Um, while um, for uh, Shelka 04, they got uh, Shups. Shups. I, I, I can't say his name right. Um, he's going to be out with uh, injury, same with um, Kelly Guiri. Um, oh, saying his name wrong, too. I apologize for that. He's going to be out, man. So, um, they're going to be missing, um, pretty much Schalke going to be missing uh, two key players, while City missing uh, ultimately a great uh, defender, but City have a lot of defenders. The Porte could step in, whatever. Uh, same with Fernandino. They got a good midfield. Gondogan, Bernardo Silva, um, What's, what's the kid name? Phil Foden, uh, David Silva. They have so many uh, uh, midfielders. Also, Fabian Delph could step in too, man. So, you never know. Um, with City, man. So, we're going to go with a 4-3-3 for City, man. That's been a very good uh, formation for them. Uh, the wing is just the killer on the wing. And uh, Silva, both Silva, putting those through balls, direct passes through. It's just crazy. So, we're going to go with Anderson and Gold because I believe Bravo is out with an injury. Um, on the left side, we're going to go with Sinchenko. He has been very impressive for me so far, except in the last game. He wasn't really too good in the last game, man, but he's been a very good uh, left back so far for City. We're going to go with Laporte. Very impressed with this guy. I'm not sure if, what country he played for. I'm, I think he's eligible. I think he's uh, he was born in France, but he's eligible to play for uh, Spain, man. So I'm not sure why nobody called him up yet. Correct me if I'm wrong. Let me know what, team, what country he's playing for. Uh, company. He's back. He played in the last game versus, I want to say, who they play? I'm not sure. Watford. I believe, yeah, he played it versus Watford. Um, he looked good. Uh, Kyle Walker on the right. Very good. Uh, Silva uh, on, the, on the left side. Hey, oh, Bernardo Silva. Bernardo Silva. That was Silva on the left side. Gondogan um, attacking me, uh, sentiment. And uh, Bernardo Silva on the right side with Sonic. Um up top, we're going to go with Sterling. And Sterling on great form. I don't think they're going to rest him. He's going to be doing very good. Uh, I think Jesus is going to start over Aguero because he hasn't been really starting. So you definitely need him um, to start over um, Aguero, bring Aguero off the bench and replace one of the midfielders or even winger because uh, Jesus needs some goals and confidence. And uh, Sané on the, on the on the right side. Man. So, yeah, that's good formation. Sané did not start in the last game, man, but I think he should start in this game. This be a good start for him. Uh, for um, Schalke 04, we're going to go with a 3-4-2-1, man. Um, uh, it's going to be more defensively for them. They're going to be more compact and uh, prevent City from really scoring too much and probably hit them on the counterattack. We're going to go with uh, Furman in goal. Uh, Nasta Sish, I believe he used to play for City like a few years ago. Let me know. Uh, he's going to be on the, uh, the left side with uh, Sané in the center, uh, center back row. Sané is a beast, by the way, for, Sh uh, for Schalke. Uh, and uh, Stromboli are going to be on the right side in the three defense. Uh, we're going to go Men, uh, Menlin on the left side. Uh, ben, ben Tellet, the former um, the former Tottenham player, is going to be in the center back row. And open, he gets some penalties so he can score those. Uh, he do score penalties for fun. He scored two penalties in the last game. That was very crucial for them in that City game. Uh, then we go with uh, Sador in the, next to um, Ben Taleb. And we're going to go with uh, McKinney on the right side, man. So, shout out to McKinney. Uh, McKinney has been doing a very good job, man. Good to see an American doing very well and playing the Champions League. Uh, so, shout out to McKinney. Um, up top, we're going to go with uh, Skrzybalski. Probably saying his name wrong. I apologize if I do. We're going to go in Bola, man. Um, Bola, bro, you used to be so good, bro. You have been impressive. You, you have not been impressive, man. Like, you, you was a good wonder kid, but... You're growing up now, man, and uh, you didn't have a, such a good World Cup. You have to step up, man, and this is the right time to step up for your team. So, hope to see you do some good things tomorrow. 
and we're gonna go with Burke Steller up top in the attack in the striker Roman. So uh, my prediction, man, is seven. The three two win, a three zero win for City, or at least a two zero win for City, man. I think City is gonna beat them easily, uh, especially them at home and they have a great form, man. But this is football; anything could happen, man. Expect the unexpected. Uh, Plays you really gotta watch out for is uh, David Silva, Ryan Sterling, Mars. I forgot all about Mars, man. Mars been on great form. Um, Sane, Aguero, yeah, those are the guys you gotta really watch out for. For um, Shelka up four, man, Makini has been fantastic so far. Same with um, with uh, Sane, I've been very impressed with Sane and goal. Same with uh, Montalem, uh, he's been very good in midfield, man. So if they get those penalties, he's gonna score those easily, man. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. If you do, like, subscribe, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. With that, you boys, out